What's going on Lego Maniacs? It's Ty, the Lego guy here. And today we're gonna show you guys how to mod the 31109 Creator Pirate Ship. I know a lot of you guys really like this set, including myself, but one thing that I've seen a big complaint with this is the brick built sails. And personally, I don't like them either. So we're gonna show you guys how to easily mod this ship. I was actually very surprised how easy you can do it. It takes less than five minutes. You're looking at about 30 US though if you wanna make this change, but considering this set goes for about 100 US plus 30 US, that's still far cheaper than buying maybe one of the old school pirate ships at this scale just because pirate sets really appreciate in value. Anyways, uh, this should get interesting and I think it's gonna really help you guys out if you're on the fence about buying it or if you just wanna mod your pirate ship and make it uh, you know, the best you can. Anyways, enough talk, let's get right into it. And to start us off, we'll show you guys the pieces that you'll need to mod the Creator Pirate Ship. Fun fact, if you own the Brickbeard's Bounty, you don't need to buy any pieces. You literally can just use the pieces that are on that set. That's kind of what I did. But if you don't, it's not a big deal. The biggest thing you're gonna need are these sails. So you need these two big sails for the masts and this front one basically just to stick at the front of the ship. You also need some flags and a couple other little pieces. I will link the pieces that you'll need to mod this ship in the description in case you're using BrickLink or what have you. I will say eBay is pretty good to get sales. I've seen a number of them as we throw this up on screen. Going for about, uh, what is that? It's roughly 30 US. You can actually pick up these sales or sales like them for not too much money if you're not picky. And uh, yeah, you can very easily mod this ship as we'll get into. I was actually, again, surprised how easily you can do that. Anyways, let's uh, show you guys how you can kind of mod the set once you have the pieces. So first things first, we'll just remove all the different little elements you don't need. So basically, all the brick built sails is kind of what you're gonna, you're gonna wanna get rid of. And if I'm going over this too fast, just slow it down. That's the beauty of YouTube, is you can go backwards. But basically all we're doing is removing what we don't need. I will show it on camera, just so you guys uh, can follow along exactly what I've removed in just this next clip. And here we have all the pieces that you wanna remove all next to each other. Basically what you're removing is the sails, anything that's white and part of the mass because uh, actually it makes it easier to mod this, just removing it completely. And the little flags and whatnot is pretty well all you want to remove. Let's show you guys now how to uh, mod the pirate ship. Now the first thing you'll want to do is flip this little pole, just like so, it's very easy. And then you want to attach the little antenna piece to it. Now what you want to do, well we'll get into this actually in a little bit. Before we do that, you'll just want to attach this sail. And how you kind of do it is Flip this around, the little blue piece, the blue Technic pin, stick it in like so, and then you'll actually want to remove this as well, there's some stragglers. You'll need a couple more of these little blue pins, or whatever, whatever color, just basically those Technic pins that are in the uh, description. They actually, There's a number of them included in the set, and uh, just attach them like so. So now you got your first mast, pretty easy. Like I was very surprised how easily you can do this. Now, once you've done that, you can attach the front sail. So what you wanna do right here is take this little brown stud and you see the little hole right here in the Technic piece? Well, this is a little tricky, but you wanna attach this to that. That actually took me about five times to try and get in there, but we got it. Take the little antenna piece, just stick it in like so, and this is where the chain comes into play. So what you wanna do now is take the chain, 
put it around the mast, top of it. If you guys have any questions about how I did anything, just leave in the comments too if something's not making sense. But again, it's pretty straightforward. Then you just attach that chain that you guys uh, saw just to the front sail. And that's the finished product. That's uh, pretty well how you wanna do it. At least that's how I modded mine. We'll now move on to the second mast. This one's actually a lot easier than the front. So literally same exact thing. In this case though, you don't have to deal with the front sail, which is really nice. You don't have to deal with that chain and all that good stuff. Here, I'm even doing it wrong. You actually want to take that Technic pin and actually put it on the bottom. So you're flipping around some things. It's not exactly like the Creator Pirate, pirate Ship, you know, with the brick built sails and how they did that. So same thing though. And that's pretty well all there is to it. Next thing we're gonna do is just attach the flags, which is extremely easy. So I like to stick one of the smaller ones right here. You can mix it and match like any way you wanna do it, what you think looks best. But this is kind of how I did mine. And then in the back here, I don't like brick built sails. Well, not sails, flags as well. I prefer the printed pieces. And that's pretty well all there is to it. Let's give you guys a 360 view of what it looks like finished. And here she is. So let's give you guys a 360 view of her with all the mods done. Now, don't get me wrong. I think that the Creator Pirate Ship looks actually pretty decent with its brick built sails, but I think it just looks it looks better. The sails. I mean, Lego has been making these cloth sails for years. I was very surprised when they didn't go with it with the Creator Pirate Ship, but it is a three in one set. So they maybe wanted to use those sail pieces to build the other two models. But yeah, that pretty well does the mod video. Again, if you guys have any questions about how I did this, if something didn't make sense, feel free to uh, ask me in the comments. But yeah, all in all, I think it just looks way better. But let me know what your guys' thoughts are on it as well. Maybe you like the brick-built sails a bit better. I just think that this looks a lot more authentic. And it looks a lot more like an original pirate ship that we got maybe back in the 80s and 90s. But yeah, that pretty well does the video. But if you liked it, leave it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, definitely consider subscribing. And click that bell so you're notified for any future mod videos. We've done one on the at, -AT now the Creator Pirate Ship. If there's actually any sets that you guys would like me to mod and you think could maybe be a bit better, leave it in the comments as well because I'm always anxious to uh, maybe improve on a Lego set that we did get in the past. But that pretty well does the uh, mod video. But if you liked it, leave it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, definitely consider subscribing and click that bell so you're notified for any future mods that we do. And actually, if you guys have any ideas for any sets, maybe that are on shelves right now that you'd like me to maybe uh, make a change, maybe, you know, see if I can improve it, leave it in the comments. But yeah, that pretty well does the uh, video again. But thanks again for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one.